You said we might go out fishing. Don't take much persuading to get me to go fishing. Let's go to my boat. Good. Here she is. You mind rowing? Sure. What are we fishing for? Yeah. Only one thing worth catching in this lake. The great tyrant. Oh. You ain't gonna last much longer out here if you don't know how to hunt. Come on. I'll show you. All right. But you better not try any funny business. <laughs> As well you may. I've been a bad man. Silence! These charges This are... is not a court where you shall be tried. This is a place where your sentence is to be carried out. And your sentence, Damn. Cole Modriscoll, is that you are to be hanged by the neck until you are dead. Let's get you off to Boston before any more your relatives show up. That might be wise. Hey, you there. Yeah? This couple is heading up north to the Boston line. They got money, they'll pay you on arrival. That work for you? Yeah, sounds fine. Get on in. Salutare tuturor și bine ați revenit la un nou episod din seria Red Dead Redemption 2. În episodul trecut am încercat să ajutăm pe nativi indieni să facă pace cu armata colonelului Favors, dar din păcate acest tentativ a noastră a ieșuat. După care l-am salvat pe capitanul Monroe și în urma acestei acțiuni a noastre, din păcate, am pierdut căluțul. A fost ucis de tren. Imediat după ce s-a terminat episodul, a venit un alt tren și l-a călcat. Și am fost și am cumpărat alt căluț. Un Fox Trotter de data aceasta. Părea să aibă stețuri mult mai bune. Și am venit aici, la acest lac, la Hamish Sinclair. Hai să vedem cine e Hamish Sinclair și ce vrea de la noi. Cred că e acel veteran pe care l-am ajutat, pentru că acesta e calul lui. The door's open. Hey, Mish. Arthur. Well, come in. You said we might go out fishing. Don't take much persuading to get me to go fishing. Let's go in my boat. Good. Here she is. You mind rowing? Sure. What are we fishing for? Yeah. Only one thing worth catching in this lake. The great tyrant. Oh. <laughs> mean as hell, Northern Pike. Uh. Eats everything else that spawns around here, its own kind included. Well, is that our bait then? A jack or something? Hell no. He's a clever old bastard. <laughs> I made these. This one's mine. You're gonna have to spare. They are pretty. You don't know the half of it. <laughs> Come on, let's push off. I'll show you where we're rowing to. Ni se vedem vrea să prindem un pește pe care îl denumește tiranul. He don't keep far away from me, the tyrant. Wants me to know whose lake it is. We'll show him who's boss. <laughs> the optimism of you. Right here. We'll cast off towards the island. Okay. You got that lore I gave you? Get her out. Spent years working on that, finding the right combination of feathers, twine, and glimmer, making them, losing them, getting them right. I tried coins, shell cases, even a medal. Finally found something he seems to like. And now I hear you can buy him in a shop. Well, it wouldn't be quite so satisfying getting him with something shop bought. Easy for you to say, <laughs> but maybe I'm inclined to agree. Something? Uh, I got 
That's something all right. <laughs> uh, hey, him. Hey, you need Come on now, Tyrant. I got you. I got you. Come on. What is selfie, Prince? Anything? It's just my rod. We got my toes too. They weren't wooden. You want another go at him? I still got my lure. Nah. He's your fish now. Cast away. We'll come at him from the other way. Row over there. When he bumped me, I had to check twice. Thought I'd find a chunk of me missing. Man eating pirates? That would be a first. I'm not so sure. Okay, right here. Our hopes of catching this bastard lie with you. Cast back to where we were, and make sure to use that lure I gave you. I think... I think I hooked him. Real. Let's land the bastard. Reel it in. Don't let him pull you. Stop a second. You snap the line, you reel when he's fighting like that. Sorry for. You caught him. That's 
throw back. Here, here. Oh, the holder. <sighs> Pass me the tyrant. That is if you're sure you don't want them. <laughs> oh, I ain't gonna poach from your pond. <sighs> well, I'll give him his honors then. He sure was something, huh? <sighs> <clears throat> Thanks for taking me out. I appreciate the company. That's one hell of a fish. Ain't he something? <laughs> so long. Hey, you ever want to go out hunting? You stop by again. I may. Okay. Ne invita și la o partidă de vânătoare. Hai să vedem, mai avem o misiune undeva în nord. să vedem dacă găsim ceva în această clădire.
to be our little adventure. <laughs> uh, you all right there? Who are you? Oh, it's okay, ma'am. I don't mean you no harm. <laughs> well, it makes no difference now. If, if an outlaw or a wild animal doesn't get me starvation, well... We came out here from the city in search of a different life. Something true, something real. All this squandering and indulgence, we wanted to strip it away, to find something authentic. <laughs> what a pair of fools. Is there a train station or a town I can take you to? No, I can't give up now. He wouldn't want that. I, I can't have it. I'm gonna do this for you, Cal. Well, I'll, um, I'll leave you to it. <laughs> Is there anything left for you to eat? Nothing. No, we didn't know the first thing about hunting. We couldn't even catch a darn mouse. If you need any poisonous berries, though, I'm a natural at finding those. Well, you ain't gonna last much longer out here if you don't know how to hunt. Come on, I'll show you. All right. But you better not try any funny business. You know, I may be weak, but I still know how to stand up for myself. Oh, I don't doubt it. Come on. Hey, so this is Parik Matrivi. So I'm watching some Savannah. Tell me, you ever skin an animal before? No, but then again, I haven't caught much of anything either. Well, you'll need to know how to do both if you're gonna survive out here. I am all too aware. So where should we head for? Uh. Let's try in the trees down there, near the river. What happened to your husband, if you don't mind me asking? A bear got him. It was horrifying. He survived, but only for a couple of days. I, I buried him a week ago. Uh, I'm sorry. This was really his dream more than mine. I'd have hopped the next train back to Chicago if he'd said the word. But now, I, I don't know, it's hard to explain. Stay quiet and still watch me. seen enough blood for one day. <laughs> Do you mind if we head back now? Sure. I'll walk you back. You did good. That should keep you fed for a few days. Oh, yes. At least. Thank you so much. I mean, this really ain't such a bad spot. You got a good water source. It's remote, but you can survive here all right. I have no doubt that one can survive here. Whether Charlotte Balfour can is a different matter entirely. You've probably lived your whole life in the outdoors. Oh, a lot of it, that's for sure. I barely left the city before coming here. 
Cal spent his summers growing up at his grandparents' lodge in Maine, but I get the impression they did more punting than hunting. Right. Oh, Lord. No. We're done. <laughs> I'd be dead now. You got a rifle? Yes. Well, my my husband's. I suggest you learn how to use it. Now, oh, come on, let's get you home. Since we got here, it feels like every step forward has come with a hundred steps back. People always talk about the simplicity of country life, but there's nothing simple about any of this. Uh. I guess we only know what we know. Oh, please. I'm sure it wouldn't take you too long to adjust to a life of privilege and indolence in the big city. I don't know about that. It sounds off. Oh, it is. A truly empty and boring existence. But an undeniably easy one. I still can't believe he's gone. Thank you. That was the first time anyone's done anything nice for us. For me, since we got here. Well, nature provides, but she sure don't always make it easy. That she doesn't. I'd invite you in, but I'm dead on my feet, if you'll forgive the pun. <laughs> Please do call again sometime, though. A good rest, and hopefully I'll be a new woman. You take care, ma'am. Ok, am ajutat-o și pe Charlotte. Cred că va fi destul de greu de una singură, dar o să descurce ea. Hai să vedem, mai avem două misiuni principale. Vom merge prima dată la Sadie. Din ce zicea Daci are ceva scoruri de încheiat cu Colmodriscol. Hai să vedem. You ain't welcome in these parts. Au făcut o greșeală când au atacat.
Dacă toți suntem aici, hai să mergem și la magazinul de haine. Să vedem ce mai este nou. Cred că intrarea este pe partea cealaltă. Eu cred că este închis, de aceea nu putem intra. so riled up today is a great day arthur today is the day they are going to hang comb o'driscoll uh so rather they hang him or i shoot him oh they are gonna hang him yeah and not before time that boy's been on the gallows more than most i wouldn't count anything until his neck's broke well nor would i which is why despite us being wanted men We're gonna attend the event ourselves. And follow him onto the scaffold? Well, let's hope not. But if I could see that son of a bitch breathe his last, I think I'd die a happy man. We are gonna disguise ourselves. In this? In this. Ok, deci Dash vrea să ne deghizem să mergem să participăm la spânzurătoarea lui Col Modriscol. Ok. Come on. Well, don't we just look the part? We'll cut through the alley to get to the gallows. We keep our weapons holstered, our disguises on, and our wits about us. Mrs. Adler, might I say, being a fancy woman of San Denis shoots you. <laughs> I'd dress up like the Queen of Sheba if it meant seeing that son of a bitch swing. Colm hung me up, nearly butchered me. I don't mean I'm comfortable in this woolen coat. Don't dawdle, Mr. Morgan. If we ain't missed it, it's this way. You made it out of that predicament, as I remember, Mr. Morgan. My husband weren't so lucky. You lost your husband. I lost my darling Annabelle. That poor boy, Kieran. We've all lost something because of Comb. And that is why we will shepherd him to eternity. Amen to that. Now keep those fingers off those triggers because we'll need cool heads and calm dispositions to see this done. <laughs> Practice what you preach, brother. Whatever do you mean? Are you gonna keep your cool? Really? When you seem to lose it all so often now. This doubting and questioning of yours? I miss the old Arth. Don't we all? You two quit it. We all got a job to do. We're all in rough agreement about how we're doing it. As far as I can tell. Exactly. We'll get it done, all right. All right, then. Come on. We got a hanging to witness. Look here. 
Don't the public love an execution? All right, good. Now, you see that pair of assholes? Sure. They're Combs boys. Yes, I think so. What a surprise. I'm glad we're here. What are they pointing at? I don't know. We gotta follow them to find out, you know. Oh, here comes somebody. <clears throat> Stay here. Go brush that horse, officer. Yes, sir. The crowd came to see a show. We don't want to disappoint them. I guess they did miss their chance to see John swing by his neck. Hey, hey. You know I wasn't going to let it come. Hey, sell your money, purchase your drink. Call, so we don't need to seduce. Probably plan to sell it, liberate the pecol. This isn't the time to question either my decisions or yours. Here and now, Comb O'Driscoll's going to get his. He's turned down there. Let's go. Quiet. What's it look like? A bunch of cops. Well, how many? Enough. So what do you think? Paul's up on the roof. Once he starts shooting, we have to have our wits about us and move fast. Yeah, I guess we faced worse than this before. <laughs> sure. Let's get to it. Yeah. So, they got a guy up on the roof overlooking the gallows. Find a way up there, on one of these verandas, through a building maybe, and get him. And do it silently. Well, obviously, I'm going to do it silently. I want to see this bastard swing. Oh, Arthur, here's a ladder. Find a way up to the roof and stop it. I'll go back to Mrs. Adler. Where's this shooter then? Hai să vedem, va trebui să-l găsim pe lunetistul care e undeva pe acoperiș și să-l împiedicăm să-l salveze pe col. impunity. Today, justice catches up with him. <laughs> As well you may. I've been a bad man. Silence! These charges This is not a court where you shall be tried. This is a place where your sentence is to be carried out. And your sentence, Colmo Driscoll, is that you are to be hanged by the neck until you are dead. This is not a task we take lightly. 
It is not a task we enjoy, but it is a task we must carry out if our civilization is to prosper. Gentlemen, are we ready? Call Modrisco. May God, in his infinite wisdom, have mercy upon your soul. Okay, până la urmă se va întâmpla. Now you know how it feels to watch somebody you love die. You ruined my life! Okay. Take it on, Arthur. Well, and we saw the bastard hang okay, but <coughs> no thing ain't gonna save us. I guess that's one less thing to worry about. I guess compared to the entire government, in the end, Como Driscoll didn't seem like such a worry. A letter came for you. Oh, okay. I know it's from that Mary. Mary? She ain't worth it, Arthur. Who is? Se vede mo scrisoare de la Mary. My dear Arthur, you never showed up. And now, after looking at the newspapers, I understand why. I don't imagine you'll receive this letter, but I nonetheless must send it. Arthur. Oh, Arthur. I was just starting to dream the silliest and softest of dreams. I miss you, and I will always miss you. But I cannot live like that. And it seems you cannot live any other way. When I'm with you, the world makes sense. But when we are apart, I see clearly that your world is not a world from which one can escape. I'm so sorry. For everything. For everything long ago and for starting up that business again. There's a good man within you, Arthur. But he is wrestling with a giant. And the giant wins time and again. You've broken my heart again. And I fear I have broken yours. And for that... I will never forgive myself, but you must let me go now. I enclose a ring you gave me many years ago, when we were both young. Not because I don't like it, but because I care for it far too much, and it reminds me too much of you. I hope one day you will find some people in love who can use this, for it kept me thinking of you all these years. And I hope by returning it to you, I can finally be free. Goodbye, Mary. Asta a fost o scrisoare de despărțire.
Hai să mergem să ajutăm și pe Penelope. Am lăsat-o să aștepte destul de mult. Vom folosi punctul de fast travel de la căruța noastră. You came, you finally came. I came. Oh, thank you, thank you, you lovely, lovely man. Well, calm down, miss. Oh, come on, let's go. We ain't got a minute to lose. They killed her. They killed Miss Calhoun. All she wanted was a better lot for women, and they killed her, those pigs. Who killed her? I don't know. My cousins, probably, or, or bows. Well, you met them. They are animals. Not even animals, monsters. Monsters, if God had lost all his powers of imagination. Can you, can you please take me to the train station? Bo will be waiting. Bo, why couldn't he come and rescue you? Well, if they saw me and him together, they'd lynch him and send me off to a nunnery. Or maybe they'd lynch us both, I ain't quite sure. They do so love hanging folk. Where are you heading? Up to Boston. Good. Yeah, I like you up there. Come on. Let's go. Of course. I'm in your hands. Just get me to Rhodes Railway Station. Okay. Let's try and get you a train. And Bo's just waiting at the station in the hope you'll show up or I'll show up to help you show up. He goes to there every day he can. Makes up some excuse or other. I said he would see me there one day soon, and today he will. God willing. Well, well. If he's there, that's true love, all right. I've hardly seen him since the rally. They watch me so carefully, and he's waited, or so his letters say. Our families won't let us out. And then all that business with Aunt Catherine and my cousins. <sighs> you saw the house. And then Lee Gray and those boys killed. So much bloodshed. I, you'd think this could be a new beginning, but everyone left alive. They're even more angry. Maybe anger's a complicated thing to let go of. Something good has to come out of this awful, awful feud. That's what I've been hoping. Bo and I have to be better. Our families were here for years and years. Sometimes I feel like we can't just leave death and, and pain and ruination behind us. Plenty before you have. 
Plenty will again, but yeah, as far as it goes, get out, don't look back, make something decent of your lives. There he is. Oh, it's him. Will you ride on the train with us a little, just to the first stop? Fine. You came! <laughs> you came! What last you came! Oh, Bo, my sweet, my best of men. <laughs> oh, I'm hardly a man at all. But I love you, Penelope Braithwaite. <sighs> Sir, how can we ever repay your kindness? Mm, some of them jewels would do just fine. Bo, Arthur's gonna join us. I think we need the support. Please, could you buy the tickets, dear Mr. Morgan? We, we can't chance being seen. Sure. Thank you. We'll meet you on the platform. Good evening, sir. <clears throat> Can I have three tickets to San Denis, please, sir? Of course. <clears throat> oh, hello, sir. Hello, Alden. I hope all is well. Uh, not terribly, but good to see you. Hey, cousin. No, hey, no, you leave us alone. Penelope, get back. Okay, so pare ca avem probleme. Get on the train, get your bags, miss. I got this. Come here, Yankee. With pleasure, you goddamn fool. You don't want to come back here without giving you a whip. We should have done this last time. Get on the train. Go to your walk. Four fists and maybe one brain between you. You're going to get hurt, cowboy. Get him, Scott. That work, bro. If that is his real name, I... it doesn't matter. He can fight. Oh, now there's only one. That is quite a family you've got there, son. I know. Charming to the last. Then again, my uncle used to keep his own half-brother as a slave. So, what do you expect? Good manners? My uncle used to say things were better the way they were when he could rape and kill with impunity and he didn't have to work a day in his life. Both our families. There's good people in this county, but our families bullied them and drove most of them off. Whites as well as blacks, all over this silly feud. Yeah, well... How to life. Oh, my lord. What? Oh, I think it's my second cousin. These goddamn cousins. I think they found out about the jewels. All right, keep your heads down. Don't deal with this. Jewels? I knew you.
Is that the driver? He's abandoning! Us. Hold tight. Hold tight, all right? I'll take a look up front. What will you do? I'll figure it out. It's best you go on alone from here. Mr. Arthur, I didn't know you could drive a train. Neither did I. But if I'm honest, it was kind of fun. <laughs> and I didn't kill any of us. Well, I killed some of your relatives, but they would have killed all of us. You are a gentleman, sir. Oh, no, I ain't. Yes, you are. Here, I ain't got much money, but these sapphires are worth a lot of money. Old family heirloom. That Braithwaite treasure. I see, Lesson. Cyber never wear the bun in Boston. No. Let's get you off to Boston before any more of your relatives show up. That might be wise. Hey, you there? Yeah. This couple is heading up north to the Boston line. They got money, they'll pay you on arrival. That work for you? Yeah, sounds fine. Get on in. Hey, uh, you carry protection on a journey like this? <laughs> Wouldn't be much of a stage driver if I didn't. Goes everywhere I do. Hey! <gasps> Miss Braithwaite is going to hold on to this until arrival. Hmm? On account of the treasure on your person. I don't know how to thank you. Uh -huh. You're a fine man, sir. Just get out of here. I'll leave. Yeah! Okay. Come on to this episode. Mulțumesc tuturor celor cărora a rămas până la final. 
Dacă v-a plăcut, nu uitați să lăsați și voi un like, un subscribe. Eu am fost Mr. M și ne auzim data viitoare.